Hey there, this is Hari from High Five Hari, and today we are going to see the life of one of the most important rulers of the medieval period. We are going to look about Prithviraj Chauhan. So come on, let us learn more about this ruler. Who is Prithviraj Chauhan? Prithviraj Chauhan was the most powerful ruler of the Chauhan dynasty, also known as the Chahamanas. He ruled the Sapadalaksha, the traditional Chahamana territory, in present-day northwestern India. He controlled much of the present-day Rajasthan, Haryana, and Delhi, and some parts of Punjab, Madhya Pradesh, and Uttar Pradesh. His capital was located at Ajayamiru, present-day Ajmer. Early in his career, he proved to be a valiant ruler, defeating many of the regional kingdoms, the most famous being the Chandelas. First Battle of Tarain, a decisive victory. During 1190 to 91 CE, Muhammad of Ghor, popularly known as Muhammad Ghori, invaded the Chahamana territory. When Prithviraj learned about this, he marched towards Ghori's army with his feudatories. Muhammad's original plan was to return to his base after conquering some of Chahamana territory. But when he heard about Prithviraj's march, he decided to put up a fight. He set out with an army and encountered Prithviraj's forces at Tarin. In the ensuing battle, Prithviraj's army decisively defeated the Ghorids. Muhammad of Ghor was injured and forced to retreat. Prithviraj did not chase the retreating Ghorid army. This proved to be a grave mistake. Who is Muhammad Ghori? Muizuddin Muhammad, or popularly known as Muhammad of Ghor, or Muhammad Ghori, was the king of the Ghori Empire. He was an ambitious ruler. He decided to invade India not just for its wealth, but also for establishing an empire. In 1175, Muhammad Ghori attacked and conquered Multan. In 1190, he conquered Punjab. Then he started messing up with the Chauhan territory, which is noted to be the beginning of the rivalry between him and Prithviraj.